months back, we all gathered for a youth empowerment and entrepreneurship program. Many resource persons were here to guide you into becoming a successful entrepreneur. Today, you shall be rewarded with certificates for the knowledge you have acquired. I would like to request Mr. Manish Kushmaji to please deliver the welcome. Guests present, the present is the agenda, they are going to thank for us. Je tiens à remercier Manish pour l'invitation à ce premier de certificat. Et je voudrais surtout féliciter tout le monde qui a pris part à ce cours de pour jeunes entrepreneuriat. Et comme vous savez, avec le problème actuel, on a beaucoup de, il y a, il y a beaucoup de, de trucs qu'on qu va mettre dans le budget concernant les jeunes entrepreneuriats au niveau du PME, etc. C'est bien de profiter de, de je, je vous félicite d'avoir, de, 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 de venir dedans, de venir euh, essayer de, 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 de self, comme on dit en anglais. Et bon, le gouvernement actuel est là pour vous encourager. Et bientôt, le, le budget va être annoncé en mars. Et de, dedans, il y, a, il y a une grosse somme d'argent qui a été allouée au PME. Il y a un petit milliard de roupies qui va être allouée. Donc, moi, je vous encourage à vous lancer le, le business, à créer de l'emploi et aussi à préparer un bon projet, préparer votre cash flow. Et si vous avez des conseils, je sais qu'il y a plein de monde dans le gouvernement, même dans, autour de vous, à vous aider. Donc, pour ça, il y, a, il y a une bonne mise en place qui a été faite par ce gouvernement actuel. Donc, moi, je vous, je vous conseille d'aller dans vos projets. C'est bien d'avoir suivi ces, ces cours que Marius a donnés. Et maintenant, il faut les concrétiser, aller de l'avant, n'ayez pas peur. Le gouvernement, le gouvernement vous accompagne, va vous suivre dans vos projets. Merci. Je pense que vous êtes tous en même couleur aujourd'hui. Il est bien et vous. Honorable Minister Dan Babo, mes chers honorables amis, Mr. Kitong Konwin, Mario Moti, dear friends, good afternoon. Indeed, today I'm here, especially because of someone whom we pamper a lot in our party. Manish Kushmaji, we all know. I would like to give a good round of applause for that boy himself, Manish, for what he is doing. I have known Manish for quite some time now, uh, well, with, uh, with our party at the PMSC. And when I knew him, he was very fresh, strong, come on, dit tango also. And today I'm very proud to see him when I hear him saying that he's behind this kind of project. And this inspires all the youth of Mauritius. Not only of Mauritius, but all around the world. It's not every day that we come across young people like him who take their future in their hands and understand what it is. Just like him, dear friends, you who are here, who have been doing this course, youth employed, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just uh, giving you, it's not a, an official speech that I'm giving, I'm just here uh, to meet you and, and to know more about what it is. So it's, the course was on youth empowerment and entrepreneurship program, if I'm not mistaken. So these kind of courses are very important in our lives if we want to be where we want to be. If you want to be an entrepreneur, it's very important to make it the way you want to make it. And maybe I'm not going to talk about, uh, let's talk myself being an entrepreneur, a women entrepreneur, I started my career from scratch, I should say. I still remember, maybe I'll, I'll just tell you, I'll give you an idea how I started, where I am today. Be, uh, let, let politics be a part. Entrepreneurship, myself, has made me what I am today. I started my career as a tourist guide 10, 15 years back. Tourist guide, then it was a small company. Then, little by little, we did a little bit of market. I did a little bit of marketing, planning, and I started doing a little bit of everything in the company. It was a small company, so I had time to put my hands in all bits and pieces. Then, with time, I still remember I was still a part-time representative at the in a hotel, and I had the 
I just say, why not? I can do it if I want, but financially it was not easy. I still remember I took a laptop, I bought a laptop. At the time there was no laptop, there was a computer from the DBM and a fax machine and I started working from home. I had some contacts and I started doing my, my company, my agency, which is known as Mr. Vacations and Events. It's a tour operator. We bring tourists to Mauritius and I started doing it from home. Little by little, with time and opportunity, I have been able to open another office in India, which was my market at that time. There how it, it's all started. What I want to say is, and with this, with this job, I came to know the minister, who was minister of finance, who, uh, sorry, of tourism, and who is today the deputy prime minister of Mauritius, Xavier Duval, who became my leader in that way. This is how destiny brought us together with the party, and I am today member of the parliament. Just to tell you, friends, that whatever you do, you have to do it with the heart and with the goodwill. There is, where there is a will, there is a way. Nothing can stop us anywhere if we want to do it. Life itself is a struggle. Tomorrow you're going to get into your business and I wish you all good luck, success and prosperity. But you will have hurdles. This will be your experience. This is going to determine your business of tomorrow. So never give up anything you do. Do it with wisdom and with the heart. This is a few words that I wanted to share with you. With that, I will tell you good afternoon. Have a nice time with us. Thank you. My colleagues, Kushmaji, Malini, Chevi, Kichong, Lekwanyo, Kanji, and uh, distinguished guest again. Good afternoon. Well, I don't think that I was supposed to make a speech today. But uh, having been here, when I see everybody, and I tell Manish, no need to be too protocol, but uh, it's a pleasure for me to make a speech, because uh, I, will, uh, I will just start like, uh, I will not talk about politics, because today there's nothing to do with politics, only the government is doing good things for our youngsters, for our newcomers in business, and this government, I can tell you, you can trust, like my leader is very, very young, so he has new ideas and we have a straightforward leadership, uh, Sani Ruchadnat and Ivan Kalandavilu and others. So, and my, and the whole team of the Lanyo Slipper, we are doing a good job and maybe I will not uh, say too much about ourselves. So you people are watching it and you, you can draw, you people can draw the conclusion yourselves. So, what I want to tell you is, I'm a guy who is fond of business. So, when I was in HSC, my, uh, I can say in uh, SC, I wanted to do business. My dad was a planter, but he was doing business, and every time when we had dinner, we had discussion, like my dad tell me at the age of 17 years old, he has been so and so. So, it was like a challenge between me and him. So, I started learning from him. Uh, we were having some plantation, and uh, in my HSC, I become uh, I was doing my studies, and I was uh, running the farm of my dad. He was uh, having a poultry farm, which was quite big. He was having like forty thousand chicken at that time, and uh, we were having some plantation, banana cultivation, and. Uh, I wanted to do more. I want to build flat. And I was too young. I was. I want. I want to be a businessman. So I go to study in Australia. When I come back, I run. Uh, we. I tell my dad I don't want to go and work for somebody else. I want to do business. But the thing is, in Mauritius, it's a pity. <laughs> Thomson, Dylan. 